So how did I become a millionaire? That allowed me to have the lifestyle that I have now and also to take care of my mom, take care of the people that I love and also do charity work. So I want to answer that question for you and hope this can inspire you. And this is not a brag, please don't mistake me, right? So when I first started out life as an 18 years old, I thought that life was just purple and pink. I thought everyone would be nice we're making a lot of money working with other people. But once the reality hit, when I worked in multiple jobs, being looked down by my boss, by my coworker, because I worked as a low task, like manual labor work, moving, tutoring, doing nails, all kind of stuff that you know that can make money. I realized that everything that I do for the past was just trading my time for money. And all of us, our time is capped. And how do we get out of the rat race? And how to stop trading time for money is we need to find something that's scalable. And that I want to share with you the type of businesses and my thought process that allow me to pick the business that help me scale. So I started with reselling stuff because during that time, I know that Amazon is something but I never get a chance to try it out. I know even about private label, but people say it's so hard. That's why I was super hesitant to start it. So I took the easier route, which is reselling, purchasing stuff from retail store at a discount price, or even go to garage sales and looking for items that I can resell on um, eBay or on Amazon if they're in new condition. I was doing a decent amount of money, but the last time when I was purchasing a ton of goods and expected to sell, I was stuck with that capital. Like with all that inventory, because it's past the season and I have a ton of inventory stock in my garage. And all of my hard work went down the drain. All of my time waking up early, stay up late, driving to the supermarket, fighting with other people just to really get the deal of that discounted item. Everything just, poof. The money is great, but it's not sustainable. Because I always have to do is source it, package, ship it, and take care of customer service. Not worth it. And that's when I realized I have to find something that is scalable. And that's when I need to learn the word keyword leverage. So when you can get to leverage other people money, the system, knowledge, and the infrastructure that would allow you to have that ultimate scale because it's no longer just you in the business. You're leveraging and partnership with people. Let's say for example, right now I'm doing Amazon white labeling or brand building or another word, private label. I'm able to partner with Amazon because they have a store online with 300 million customers that they have already made a relationship with. They have infrastructure across America that you can tap in, store your products to ship it out whatever a customer purchasing. And they even do the shipping for you and handle the customer service through their employees. So Amazon basically become your manager, manage your warehouse, manage the employee, hiring, firing, customer service, and finding the customer for you. And your ultimate job is to know how to digital marketing so that you can figure it out what are the things that the customer like, you come up with that offer, and all you need to do is run PPC which is pay-per-click, another form of advertising on Amazon. That's pretty much it. And that allowed me to right now, I'm traveling, and I'm still able to make money on autopilot because the system is run by itself with all the advertising stuff and also with Amazon being there. I don't have to do all the legwork like what I used to do before in my reselling businesses. And you know what? With the product that I launched, I bought the product at 
rock bottom price, so there's no lower bottom price. But with reselling, there is still a markup with the retail store. And you don't even factor into the cost of gas, the cost of your time. So let's say if you make it $30 an hour and you go and sort four products, and that product costs you, let's say, an hour, you have to factor those time in. But for me, with white label or private labeling, all you need to do is press a button telling your manufacturer in China that, hey, you need more products. And they just send it to Amazon warehouse. Like, you don't have to worry about it. And the cost of good is very low. That would allow you to be able to market up three times more and sell it on Amazon. Okay? So, my point here for you is scalability. Asking yourself, is your current business have that scalability factor? Can you, let's say, take a day's off and can your operations still run? Let's say, can you be sick? And is your operation still running? Can you be traveling? And is your operation still running? If not, you have to ask yourself, how can I leverage? Because when you're being at a business, you're taking away your time from your family, from yourself, and sooner or later, we all running out of time. Okay? Our time in this world is scarce, and we don't know how much time we all have left. And let's say, let's be positive here. Okay? We're gonna have 60 years, 60 candles. Most of us here already blew half of it already, right? So you only have 30 years left, but it's not guaranteed. And the life expectancy for us now is getting smaller and smaller. And the day that we were born is the day that we all die. Slowly, gradually, to not. So don't waste your time building your business or neglecting your family and your loved ones. Give yourself three years. That's exactly what I told myself. I'm going to give myself three years building my own Amazon property brand because I have saw my mentor. His name is Charlie. I put a link of his profile down so you can follow him. He has sold his eight-figure business and he became a billionaire at 27. He passed on that knowledge to me and that allowed me to fast track my progress and achieve the result faster. It may took him five years to become a millionaire. It becomes shorter for me three years. And I know if you're following me, I know you can start to shortcut it as long as you have the roadmap and the blueprint. And that's why I put together a free training, a case study, of one of our students that we has helped went from a failed product to making over $500,000 in 30 days during Q4 holiday season on Amazon. While he are still in Asia, in Vietnam, or in Australia, where his home base is, he's selling in the U.S. market alone. Okay. And I hope this these games can help you create a better life for yourself and your family. And why I'm making this video, you may ask, why am I teaching you? Because I want to duplicate myself. I want to be the person to give the knowledge that other guru back in the day didn't. And also be the light at the end of the tunnel in the world of fake guru nowadays who don't have what they are preaching, don't have the knowledge, don't have the lifestyle. And they reaching you to purchasing their course and eventually making you bury your dream due to the full information. One good teacher can change your life, and so is the bad one. And I hope this video can be helpful for you. And let me know if there's any other things that I'm missing regarding the scalability, because I know on my channel, a lot of you guys are watching, and not just am 9 to 5 people, but also a business owner. I'm always about learning. I never, never stop learning. Because the more I learn, the more I will make an impact in the world. And cheer, guys. Thank you for tuning in. 
helpful. Don't forget to subscribe, like this video, please share this with those that you find.